Jason Anthony Hoshu was well primed to qualify to Tokyo 2020 in both men's singles and doubles, a rare feat at such a competitive level. But an unexpected pandemic has put the 21-year-old Canadian celebration on hold. I guess my initial reaction was uh, I was a bit sad, uh, a little bit frustrated because I think there's only one more tournament left of the qualification for us. So um, uh, one more one more weekend, then we would have been qualified, right? It, would, it was uh, very disappointing. I think at that time uh, I was playing pretty well. I was uh, I felt like my performance was uh, really good for like the last couple of tournaments. So uh, I feel like I could have done really well in the last tournament. But lately, uh, training's been really good. Uh, I feel like I'm in good shape, so uh, just trying to uh, get the body stronger, you know, uh, recover from some injuries, uh, just overall, like, improve my game. Just um, implementing uh, everything I learned from my experiences in the international tournaments and uh, bring it back into training and uh, trying to perfect everything. I think my style in singles also is uh, a bit compatible to doubles. I have that speed and power, so uh, I think it translates a little bit. Of course, there's like some uh, shots that work in singles but won't work in doubles that sometimes uh, comes out by accident, but I just try to like change my mindset in between uh, the matches. Like singles, sometimes you do like uh, like a higher net, whereas doubles, you can't really do that. If someone's already standing there, you're, you're going to get like tapped, right? Since June, I, I started going back to school. I study business and technology. Uh, it's, it's a little bit hard uh, because summer school goes really fast. You know, they put in a whole semester's worth into just two months. I usually train in the morning uh, quite early and then come back, you know, eat some lunch, then like, take a quick nap and then uh, and just study. Uh, we can't take uh, everything for granted, you know. Um, some things like you can't predict, you know. You you never know what's going to happen. So the thing is just live your life to the fullest every day and um, do your best in whatever you do every day. <laughs>